Hey guys, spent the night in the camper last night, so getting an early start this morning. Did a little fishing yesterday evening, picked up a few, but most of them were small. About 5.30, quarter to 6 this morning, my phone went off. And that was Bob telling me he was on his way, so I had enough time to grab a couple honey buns, a couple cups of coffee, and meet him at the boat ramp. Now the interesting part was the first decent fish that went over the side of the boat this morning wasn't caught by either one of us. Had one of the guys at camp here, matter of fact, he has to camp right next door. Came up with his boat and wanted to know if we'd take a picture. He had a fish he wanted to get a picture of, so had a nice bass. It was 4.08 pounds, uh, 20 and a half inches long. Pretty nice fish. But anyway, after that, Bob and I went out, started finding a few decent ones of our own. Got a fish? I got a fish. Get in here, buddy. I got a bull one. I got one. Double. There we go. Oh, wow. All right. Maybe one and a half. <laughs> yeah, both almost the same color. I mean, got some blue and stuff in them. Ah, dang it. Hold still. Yeah, he was down there too. Picked one up, huh? Hey, where'd you get that jig? I found it. <laughs> yeah. There you go, guys. Tell you, this is what good friends are for. Don gave me, I was out of jigs, and Don gave me a nice jig, and I caught a fish with it. And I, I gave him credit for it. And I really thought that was the worst jig to pick. That I, no, I'm not. No. <laughs> that worked. I'm, I'm missing the same thing. <laughs> There we go. That's a good 15 inch or at least. Ah, you damn thing broke my line. Broke the line? Broke oh, the line. Don't you flop out of the boat and some bitch still got my jig in Oh, this is a good one. This is a nice one. You know what? This, I got a big fish if I get him in a boat. Mm. Oh, yeah. He's a little bigger than mine, ain't he? Oh, darn. Mine's 15. That's nice. Mine's 15 and a half. That's nice. Yeah, that's good. Wow. Well, I measure him. Yeah. There you go, guys. Mine's 15 and a half. I've got the big one. Where did you get that jig again? Man, I'll tell you. <laughs> There you go, guy. He got me an 18-inch bass. For me, that's my uh, big one this year. I got to give Don his credit. That's that jig he just put together for me. He's caught me two bass already. And I fish with a good fish with a good friend. And I ain't doing that no more. Friend or no friend. <laughs> ah, he will. I know. <laughs> All right. Yeah, nice fish. There we go. All right. You get turn nice the... bank. Yeah, we're gonna go back and do that again. I caught two nice ones and you caught one, so we picked three fish up in there. We're gonna go back and do it again. I got a tie on what we're doing. It was a decent there. one too, 15 inches, wasn't it? Yeah, mine was 15. Yeah. So I move, let's see if he's back there. If he is, he doesn't want a jig. God damn it. Either miss it or just a tail grab or one of the two, you know? Oh, man. Then I started reeling in fast, so I was just getting close and I felt it tapped again. <laughs> so you wonder if you'd have kept it slow for, you know? Yeah. Or if it was just a jump at it because it was moving. Just reaction. There we go. Got him? Yep. There you go. Not as big as the last ones, but fish to fish. We'll take it. Now that's one I should have never got in the boat. 
bottom lip and it wasn't even hooked through. Really? I don't know how he stayed on. Tight line was the only reason he was on. Oh yeah, that's a piece of fish. Oh yeah. That's gonna be close to your other one. Yeah, I think so. Close enough we're gonna take a good look at it. You don't swing it out over the lake and lose it. Yeah. That's Wait, happening. No, it's probably 16 and a half, 17 now they got closer. Yeah, decent though. Seventeen. Seventeen. Well, you were close. There you go. One for the camera. Nice fish, guys. 17. Another nice one up in here. And it's shady too. That makes it even better. Yep. This is the second nice fish I've caught off this off this jig right here. Now Don makes these up. If you go to our page, our YouTube page, you'll find out where Don showed you how to make these. Not only do they work, it's what half price you think Don? Probably under two dollars each. Yeah so you can buy and, and I went through three jigs already today catching snags so you can save a few bucks so check out our YouTube page. I mean I'm not probably won't use a smart TV. Oh, I probably won't. That one. Well. Woo. Did you put on I, I'm I'm catching up to you. Did you put I'm, on a bigger lure? Oh no that's a fish. <laughs> I thought you just put on a big lure. Yeah. A bottom fish with a big swim bait. Where'd you get that? <laughs> Man. Well. <laughs> it's a fish. There we go, guys. Didn't have the camera on, but got the fish anyway. On a jig. That's what they've been hitting on. Incher anyway. Yeah. You're getting all the big ones today. Yeah. 15? Probably. Gotta be close to it anyway. Yeah. 15. 14, 15. Uh -huh. It'll stay. Go get bigger. Well, anytime you put a half dozen fish over 15 inches in the boat, that ain't too bad of a day. Bob got big fish on us with the 17 inch and the 18 inch. But all in all, quality was pretty decent this time around. We caught a few on the crankbaits. Basically, it was a jig again. I'll tell you, the water temp was sitting about 80 degrees. They're down there a little bit deeper. You got to go down for them. Uh, Bob mentioned, I think, about me putting together our own jigs. And I think I mentioned something about that in our jig fishing video. But basically, I'm buying a Chompers brush jig. It's got the good mustad hooks in them. Buying my skirts and putting them together. You know, you can put one together for about two bucks. And yeah, you can buy one at Walmart for two bucks. But the quality won't be as good as the one you can put together yourself. So, Jigs did it. We'll see what works the next time. That's all you can do is go out and see what the fish are going to work with. But thanks for sticking with us. Subscribe to our channel if you would. Hope to see you again real soon.